I want to take this opportunity to reach out and speak to you, the residents of our district. I hope you all are keeping safe and well and it is now the new normal for us all. Many in our district have been shielding at home because of their medical condition and from the 31st of July, shielding has been paused. As many of these people will be understandably nervous and anxious about leaving their homes, I would like to remind everyone to continue to be vigilant and take care when out and about. Since March, we all worked tirelessly together to reduce the spread of this virus and I ask that we do not become complacent as restrictions are lifted. The virus has not gone away. I stress the importance of adhering to strict social distancing, both indoors and outdoors. We all yearn to meet our friends and family. However, meeting indoors carries a higher risk. If it's possible, you should continue to arrange meeting outdoors. However, if inside, you should ensure that everyone follows the public health guidance at all times. When out and about, we've been asked to assume that everyone we encounter may have been shielding. And as an act of kindness and consideration, ensure that we maintain social distancing and that we wear a face covering indoors. It's important that we do not get a false sense of security about the level of protection provided by a face covering. The wearing of face coverings protects others from you, not you from others. And we must not use them as a replacement for other social distancing measures. So whilst wearing your face covering, please continue to practice social distancing as much as humanly possible. Wash your hands thoroughly and often throughout the day. And also catch it, kill it, bin it when you sneeze or cough. I would also stress the importance of wearing and disposing of your face covering correctly. I understand how difficult this has been for everyone, but following the guidance is the best way to protect yourself and others from COVID-19. I will conclude by thanking you all for your hard work over the last months, number of months, and I wish you and your family well as we navigate through these really difficult times. And it is important that we remember that this won't always be forever. Thank you.